Wheelchair ramps. OXO Good Grips kitchen utensils. Voice controlled computers. What do all these objects have in common? They are all designed to be used by people with disabilities. That much seems obvious about the wheelchair ramp, and maybe you even know that the original OXO vegetable peeler was designed for someone with arthritis. But have you considered that features like voiceovers, text to speech, or Siri began as aids for the visually impaired? That brings us to the second thing these objects and many others have in common. They were originally designed for people with disabilities, but are equally usable, even preferable, for those without disabilities. Make a product intuitive enough to use by someone with blindness, and sighted users will find it equally user-friendly. Design a wheelchair so sleek, people who can walk want a version without wheels for their living room. We already have people who don't need glasses wearing them as a fashion statement. Why not make every product as usable and desirable for both people with and without disabilities? When you design for the minority, you design for the majority.